another YouTube video. This is not going to be the main intro, but y'all, today's a, a vlog. It's currently Wednesday. It's my off day. So I just woke up and I wanted to cook like a good lunch. So we're going to start the vlog off with... We're going to start the vlog off with um, going to the grocery store and picking up some stuff. I want to cook a steak. Steak bite um mac and cheese i'm not sure what sides i want to do but i just call my driver or whatever so he should be like on the way so i'm gonna get in the shower charge my camera up a little bit that's one thing i can't find y'all i'm gonna just get in the shower and stuff oh here we go okay y'all i'll be back Okay, y'all, so I'm in here and I have brought my, um, it's in the trunk, but I have brought the little wagon thing because I don't know how, I honestly don't even know what the recipe requires. This one I'm trying to make, steak bites and macaroni and cheese. I've never made a macaroni and cheese before, but it should be easy if I follow this TikTok. <laughs> I like writing like a list of everything that I need. I need a lot of cheese. Okay, y'all. So I just got here. Are these bookies wet? Okay, I was thinking about buying. Uh, um, I can't really hear myself. Should I buy you? I need some flowers. I'm already distracted. Everywhere I go, I, I get distracted. Focus, focus, focus. I already have a list of everything that I need on my phone. So, I need a lemon. I'm so late. You want to say it's my vlog? Yes. What's up, vlog? What's up, guys? <laughs> Sugar, what's up? I know that's right. I hope they sell cast irons here because I want to get me a cast iron because the way I want to cook the um cook the mac and cheese I want to put it into a cast iron oh my god just made it look like my dad <laughs> thank you um, more spices I feel like we have a good um variety of seasonings but I feel like it could be better so some adobe seasoning. Oh, boom, she got the recipe right here for me. Garlic, salt, pepper, steak, and I don't have all of that. Oh, I'm gonna go get the steak, the noodles, and the cheese. I'm trying to find stuff your mama, but I can't find it. Y'all, I'm getting an actual knife. The knife we had is really small, so I'm getting us a new knife. We have a big spoon. I don't really need a measuring thing. We have tongs. We don't have tongs. Can we get some of these we have the cast iron here, so I think I'm gonna get the cast iron. And I don't know what side she would have with this, but I'm sure like if you was having steak, a mac and cheese would be the side. So I don't know if I need to get any more. I do need some more paper plates. These are the best. I'll get the steak, the cheese, and macaroni. Oh, they already have steak bites. Should I get the ones that's already? This look good though. Boneless man in it. I think I'm gonna get this. Gotta give me some cool whip. Y'all, I be eating Cool Whip like it's ice cream. Because I got some um, uh, ice cream cones. And because when we were younger, my grandma used to um, make us ice cream cones. And I have some vanilla ice cream in the freezer. Can't find the noodles. I want the noodles that curve. These. So I get two packs of these. They're only one dollar. I'm gonna get two pack. And now I need to get some something to drink, and then I'm out of here. 
Okay, y'all, this is all the stuff that I got. Y'all, take a quick guess and tell me how much y'all think it's gonna be. So pause this video and comment down below. It's gonna be closer to 200. All the real <laughs> I'm trying to be assessed today, Reggie. Okay, okay. Hopefully, I got everything that I needed. I know I got more than what I needed. I got unnecessary stuff. I don't even need groceries but y'all my comforter did come so we're gonna unpack that a little later oh, and i got some more paper plates this is the cast iron you don't need no weapon when you got a cast iron not on you putting stuff I don't need. Why well, I'm gonna just set everything aside, put stuff that I don't need away. Don't need this, don't need that. Need that, need that. Let's put this in the refrigerator. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna put everything away. Okay, ingredients right here we got some steak the cast iron the mac and cheese seasonings milk butter lemon stuff for the steak all my utensils so i really just want to put y'all somewhere where y'all could stay so i'm really thinking here i'm really thinking here and i could do everything right there um i'm I'm trying to see if I should put the other light up or is this enough light? I'm trying to see if I should put the other light up or is this enough? I don't know. Maybe we need the other light. She's in the oven. I could be working on my steak. But I do want my steak to kind of sit in the seasonings first. So I'm going to go ahead and season my face, set that to the side, then start on my mac and cheese. Basically. So I'm going to wash my hands. And when I get everything situated, I'm going I'm to go live on TikTok. It's only gonna take me so long because I be trying to get content too. So it's kind of like add 30 minutes to the actual cooking time because I gotta get all the good content. So, so for right now we're gonna cook, put the butter up, put this up, and put this up in the cheese. So put up both. 
to the side. And y'all, I gotta charge my camera up just a little bit. So I'm gonna season it and I'm gonna get back to y'all because my camera is gonna die. So y'all just gotta work with me here, okay? Okay, y'all, so I just got done. <laughs> just the behind the scenes. Okay, y'all, so I just got done um, chopping up my steak like into bite-sized pieces. And I just have them laid flat on the cutting board because I'm going to season them and then set them to the side so that the seasoning, they can marinate in the seasoning while I start on my um, mac and cheese. And I am on live, y'all. Of course, they're on there being food critics. I don't know when they got their degree in food, but... It's okay. We all learning. They want to give me some tips. They can. This is a good angle. Now I got to find a good angle for my camera. I'm thinking on top of here. This is going to fall, I think. No. Nope. For my seasonings, we have salt, of course. This is really my main seasoning. Because this is like a steak seasoning. Like, you really, this is all you need. Um, we got adobo seasoning, of course, some garlic powder. I got paprika and cayenne, but that's for my, um, the mix, the cheese mix or whatever to go on the what you call it. You can put, I seen somebody use this on TikTok. You can put this on steak, right? Worried about to get on the counter. I'm going to wipe the counters off and stuff. Y'all should see this angle for my YouTube. It's really good. I never really understood big seasonings like this. I feel like little seasonings get into steak, like meat better. But, mm -hmm. a good toss. Garlic powder, a little bit. That's what y'all like. So I just got done seasoning um, the steak got real good. They're sitting, they're sitting in this bowl, and I'm about to cover the bowl and set this to the side so that the seasoning can get, get in there good. If I start boiling them now, I need to be fast with the sauce because noodles don't take nothing to cook. Okay, I need olive oil. Let me get all the stuff out that I need. Y'all, don't, don't ask what happened to our olive oil top because I don't know. So we just covered it with aluminum foil. I need olive oil. That's special. I got my butter. Y'all, these are the cheeses that I got. Extra sharp. And I did want like a different taste to it. So I got this other seasoning. I mean these other enterprises. I just hope I'm getting good content. I tried to find sloppy mama at Publix. They did not have it. I, don't need no rescue. I got my milk. It's good. Okay. Let's get started. So, I need a pot first. I need to fill it up with some water. But I need to get... Okay, y'all. So, we're back on track a little bit. We're going to start my meat first. Because meat doesn't take that long to cook. And it's like I could put the meat to the side. The sauce, the sauce will thicken up. It's, I feel like I need to put... As soon as I make the sauce, I need to go ahead and start putting it to the cast iron to put in the um, oven. So we're going to get my meat out the um, refrigerator. I need garlic. I'm adding a little bit of garlic to my, my meat or whatever. A little olive oil. I need this over here. I have my meat sitting. to put the meat over okay we back on track we're back on track and i'm just gonna cook them good on each side you cook your steak how you want to cook it that's why oh I think so though. I'm going to the, I'm going to the 
love the movie at 5.15. Well, I miss dinner. With who? Myself. Um, I don't know. Too late, bro. You can just put mine inside. Okay. Okay. Well, no, you still have to cook the mac and cheese. Yeah. Can you give me the, um, can you give me my charger? Okay, y'all, so my steak bite is almost done. This is the second batch of steak. And this looks really good. I'm going to let it cook for a little bit longer. Now I'm going to get ready to get into my sauce. So the first thing he did was... I still got my noodles over here. I just keep constantly stirring them. And I added some butter to them so they not... Um, what you call it? So the first thing he did was he added some butter to a pan. Okay. And then he added some butter to a pan. Okay. No, I didn't put the egg in just yet. Okay, y'all, so I've been sitting here slowly mixing this sauce up. I got on the phone with my grandma and she was telling me how to do it. But, y'all, this is what it looks like so far. And I added my seasonings and everything into it. So, I feel like everything is good now. It's just about um, putting everything inside the pan. So, I'm definitely going to call her back. But, while this is going, I'll take this off the stove. I added me an egg in there, some seasonings, some different seasonings or whatever. I still have a lot of cheese left. I don't know if I was supposed to add more cheese. I'm gonna add more cheese. A little bit more pepper. A little bit more salt because I'm not gonna lie. My grandma always told me when cooking mac and cheese, you can add a lot of salt and it's still like, you still not gonna feel like there's a lot of salt in there. So this is what I've been doing. I've just been mixing, mixing, mixing so far. I added a little bit of heavy whipping cream. I just gotta get this cheese melted. That was a step I wanted you to do so you don't have to waste extra mac macaroni. Uh, but we'll do that next time. I found this out so because sometimes you may not need you may cook too much macaroni and you won't have to use as much sauce. But put the, have you poured the sauce off in it? I'm about to pour the it over now. Pour a little bit and stir. You don't want the macaroni to be dry like when your sauce off the back, keep stirring. Don't stir too much. You don't want to break the macaroni. Okay. Yeah. It looks good. Okay, now. Hold on. I need to get my, my what you call it.
put in one, what you call it? Cover it all the way, baby. Cover it all the way. Cover everything. Cover. Oh, y'all. I hope that turned out good. I just put it in the oven, y'all. I put the whole cast iron in the oven. I hope everything be good with that. Um, right now, I'm going to just clean up a little bit. I forgot this is like a regular vlog. So, I'm going to just clean up, y'all. My storage kept running out. So, that's why I was taking like a little bit longer than usual. But everything is cooking now. I'm going to put all these dishes into the dishwasher. And I just burnt my hand with, on the stove, bro. cheese comes out good my camera's gonna die i'm gonna get back to y'all okay y'all so while that's in there cooking i um i'm gonna go get yanni long tripod i got a new comforter so my bed is coming together i'm gonna do a whole room transformation when i get like actual stuff to go in my room okay y'all we done cooking this is what it looks like so we're gonna take do a little taste test Today is a whole new day. I know I was gonna do like a spending day with me, but yesterday after I, after I cooked, I went to the movies and it wasn't really nothing much else to do after that. So today y'all, um, me and Yanni are going to um, like over by our house. It's like a plaza with like home goods and all of that in there. So we finna head over there just to get some more stuff. This is gonna be like, if I find some good stuff, then this is gonna be my room transformation video, like part one. I'm gonna do two parts because if y'all don't know, I had to cancel my Amazon package because they said that it was lost or something like that. So I couldn't get my packages from Amazon. But I know I should be able to find some good stuff from the store. Also, my comforter came and my storage for under my sinks came. So, oh, and my basket came. But right now we're just trying to like, I don't want the room to be too cluttered, but it just looks too plain now. So I'm gonna get back to y'all once we there. So. I really like y'all. Okay. <laughs> okay, y'all. So we stopped at our first store, which is Kirtland's, and they have like some really good stuff in here. And I'm looking for room stuff, room, 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 and house things. We could, we could go. They always have like cute stuff in here. Yes. Y'all, this would be perfect. This matches my, my, um, like the trim on my big blanket so good. How much is this? Only $16? You're going in there for sure. 
clothes and different things. So I'm gonna pick out. This one smells good. I think I'm gonna go with this. Oh, okay. uh, this is the linen spray that we be getting. Okay, get it. I think we need a red. Um, this. I think we need this too, Yanni. We could put it up against the like the by the stove. Oh, no. By the stove. Yeah. That's the house. Uh, this smells okay, but it's like it could be better. Smell it, Yanni. That smells good. Or this, this one's subtle. Yeah, I like that one. I'm just gonna get, I'm get one. I can get. It's for the house. But it's like we don't even use our mugs. Yeah, we need to start using them then. Okay. The kitchen mats. Yeah. That right there. Should we get two of them so one of the um, pink can stand up and one of the red can stand up? I think so. Let me check this. Oh, you have an um, email with us? Um. <laughs> okay, so we're about to go next door to Home Goods. No, this is like our, our every time we go house shopping, it's like we go to each store. Yeah. And this is like our thing. It's like Only our if thing. we could get together on the couch. Literally. Okay. So Marshall's I'm thinking. Yeah, me too. It's like it's like okay. So we're at Marshall's right now and y'all know I'm getting to like my whole perfumes or whatever. And I've just seen this one. I don't know if you guys can see. I've just seen this one right here. And it smells so good, so I think I'm gonna get it. Y'all, so I'm looking at these, um, what's it called, but my room colors are pinkish, so I'm thinking about getting this, this pillow right here. I don't want the basket, I just want the pillow. Look how cute they are, they come in three, and it has like a pink heart on them. It's only $20 like toilet scrubber too to go on the side of my okay yes now i didn't even get much stuff from here only this only these pillows and this perfume i literally oh, look so gloomy outside we're going to home goods but now we're going to home goods we need to be going to American signature, yeah. To get We're not gonna go to Ross and all of that today. That's not our type of speed today. Yeah, Ross don't really have much. But we are gonna go to American Open Door. Our driver put all of our stuff in this basket, and that is so cute. We decided to go in through the mail room because this would be probably the easiest for us. <laughs> all the stuff that we got. I feel like last time we got more stuff, but we did get some good stuff for like the house. And I think the Valentine's Day stuff is really gonna put like a good touch to it. Okay, y'all, it's a few hours later and I'm in my room. It looks very empty, but y'all are on my room transformation journey with me. So this is not everything. Like I was telling y'all earlier in the car, I ordered a bunch of stuff from Amazon. Um, but if y'all was on my TikTok live, y'all know, they freaking, um, I guess, lost the package or whatever. So I had to cancel it or whatever. So these are not packages from Amazon. This is one package from Amazon. Um, but this is not everything. I want to show y'all what I got from the store right quick. So this is from Kirtland's. I got, well, some of this stuff is house stuff. So I got um, new, like, uh, towels to go, like, over the stove. And I had to put it back here. Over the stove and over the, like, dishwasher and stuff. I got this too to go in the kitchen because I just felt like it was so cute. This is to go outside of our house on like the little ledge thing. And I'm going to put all this stuff together before I start my room. I got this throw pillow, y'all. I mean, this throw blanket, y'all. I hope y'all can see it's not too, um, too light. Also, what came from Amazon is 
this like hamper thing but i'm putting it over here by my mirror like right in front of my mirror so that when i start taking my like blankets off of my um bed because i do have a heated comforter oh i do have a heated blanket on the way i'm gonna put them in here so like my decorative pillows they'll go in here like you know just all my bad stuff that i don't want on the bed at the moment it's gonna go in here so this is from marshall's i didn't really find nothing at marshall's but i did get these cute throw blank throw pillows they say love on them and it came with three and it's different colors so this is light pink this is red and this is a dark, a dark pink which works because if y'all see my bath mat for my shower it has different shades of pink also y'all i'm adding to my perfume collection so i got this from marshall's and it smells so good it gives like it's called vanilla mousse but it smells really good it reminds me of something i don't know what Curtains that I got was these candles, and I'm gonna put these candles in the bathroom. But I got this mug. Y'all know we always get like in season mugs, so we got a Christmas mug, and this is a Valentine's Day mug. It says you and me, and the handle is like a little heart. This candle, which is a lavender oak candle, and I like it. I'm gonna put it in my bathroom since it's pink. To go in the living room and it says love struck oh this is almond amber and cedar wood but it smells like really light and i feel like that's what we need in our um kitchen okay let me go put this stuff up and then i'm gonna get back to y'all for my bed stuff really it's just my bed stuff right now we just focusing on my bed that's my main thing i'm gonna do and each one of my vlogs, I'm going to add something more to my room. So, I'm going to, so in my next vlog, I'm going to purchase some stuff from Amazon and add that to my next vlog. I know y'all wanted like one room transformation video, but I feel like it's better if y'all see it gradually like grow. So, we're working on our bed now. I forgot to show y'all. So, I got these pillows right here, I think from Home Goods, And they're just big. I always wanted like some really big pillows on my bed. And they're trimmed. I don't know if y'all can see that. They're trimmed with pink, which matches this perfectly. So I felt like all that just came together. Also, I got like a lot of more pillows. I got like four pillows on my bed. I just like when the bed feels comfortable, but I'm gonna be back to y'all once I put that up. Okay, y'all, so I'm opening up these pillows. And y'all, tell me what y'all think. Clearly y'all see I have a hard time decorating like small spaces. So y'all need to tell me what y'all think would look good in here. I don't want a aesthetically pleasing room with all the lights and the, the grass wall. Like, I want it to look clean. But I don't want it to look bland though. Like, I'm gonna cut these off. Oh, they're so cute. And perfect for a washer before I actually start like, oh my gosh, it is so soft. Scissors. Oh y'all, I hope my comforter looks cute. I y'all already know I had a bad experience with my last comforter because it felt like cardboard. So and this right here says bed in a ba bed in a bag. So we already I'm already kind of nervous. I don't know what to expect. Now even though I just bought some sheets. Um it comes with sheets and stuff. Now this is like the the comforter that I bought, it's like a creamish color. Yeah, it's like a creamy color. Okay. It, feel, it don't feel like cardboard. I'm talking about that wrap. Wrap worn thing. Y'all should be ashamed of yourself because that right there, that was cardboard. Okay. I'm going to um, strip my bed, take all this off, and basically just reassemble it. So... I'm going to just have y'all up here. Y'all, I'm just assembling it for a video. Um, I'm going to take it off and watch everything. I just got to get this video up. I told y'all I was going to have the banana, so I'm just working with it. Tint. It's like a cream, like creamish. Which works really good for my bathroom because my bathroom is like a cream. And that's the color I was going for. So, it's kind of a banana. Now, this, I don't know. I don't know if it's just like, I don't know if it's like, I don't know if it's just 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 I left the sheet white because my other pillows is white. The big pillows, they're white. And so far, it looks good. So, yeah. Okay. 
pillowcases. It's like the same texture as the comforter. So these next two. Are these the pillows that you squish in like this? I still have these white ones, which it works perfectly fine, y'all, because my headboard is like white. Well, it's like an off-white color. And for my hamper, we have my throw pillows. I told myself I was gonna give one to Yanni, so I'm gonna pick out the ones that I want. Let's see these are. Okay, y'all, so this is the room. This is the room, y'all. It does look really, 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 really good. Let me see if it's focusing for y'all. Here in the basket, y'all. The basket looked kind of lopsided because I just took it out the, the packaging and it was folded. But, yeah. This is just part one, y'all. I'm going to try to get some, like, a rug or something. I'm definitely going to get the pictures. Next vlog that y'all see is going to be me getting the pictures to go above my bed with some real skinny end tables. Okay, y'all. I got That package is for my bathroom, so I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Or should I wait and put that in the next vlog? I'm um, feel that out as well. But, yeah, y'all, my room is slowly coming together, y'all. I feel like my bed is like the centerpiece of my room, so I definitely need it some more decorations and I feel like this is perfect all I need is I want to do a rug I want to get my shelf together for my um, perfume collection and yeah my pictures and I feel like that's gonna add to the room y'all I want the room to look really simple and I feel like that's what I'm giving that's what it's giving right now and I like it simple but not too simple anyways y'all thank y'all so much for watching this video I have to edit this now it's probably nine I told y'all it will be up at nine but it's okay it's still going up today because we're not wasting no time also, if y'all see anything that y'all think I should add to my room, um, please tell me the colors are white, cream, and pink. Like, different shades of pink. So, this is pink, and then those two are a different shade of pink. But, yeah, y'all can help a girl out. Okay, bye.